Look at that beauty. Oh, wow! It's a giant, Lloydy. It's a ja massive jack. Oh, yeah, girl! <laughs> this is a big fish. Can you wind him in, buddy? Wind him. It's a big one, bud. It's a massive fish, this one. You gotta keep the pressure on it. Good boy. Tommy, look at that mangrove jack, oh. mate. Oh, my goodness. It's a fish. Oh, oh, look at him, Tom. Right, folks, well, we have put hundreds of Ks on the clock today. It's been a massive day and um, a lot of it, like fall driving, off-road, gravel roads, um, big washouts, crossings, and uh, some beautiful country. I'm falling in love with this place, but uh, we've arrived here this afternoon. We've just got out of the pool. We had a swim. We're at the Weeper Caravan and Camping Park. And, uh, mate, this place is seriously... This is like a 4x4 and fishing expo um, turned dirty. Like the red dirt is unbelievable, gets into everything. And I've had to do things to my motor. Had to try and, I'll, I'll have to show you what I've done for my tinny uh, with my mate Dave to try and protect all of the carpet platforms and everything in the tinny, the way that it's traveling. But look at this place. It's like a dream, mate. We've just rolled in. I've had a look at Google Maps. We've got some range again. And uh, so I'm going to sort some editing and uploads in the next couple of hours tonight, hopefully to get out over the next day or two. But um, tomorrow morning, going to go fishing. Um, either tomorrow morning or tomorrow afternoon. We'll just see what the kids want to do. And I'll probably have my uh, run and gun session myself as well tomorrow. We're only here for two nights. And then we're heading further north. We're going to get right up to the tip. Um, the bird life, everything here is nuts, folks. And if you haven't been up north, hopefully these videos are going to inspire you like they are me to uh, make the effort to keep coming back. I'm going to be coming back to this place. I've just fallen in love with it, like I said. So anyway, we're here tonight and um, Lauren's old man put us up in a cabin. They're traveling with us for a couple of weeks and that's part of the reason why we're running and gunning it. They've got two weeks with us and we want to see as much of the tip as we can. And then we're going to slow down when we get back down to Cairns. So I'm smashing the fishing where I can, but making sure that the family, uh, family first priority is happening. They get a taste of the fishing and the fun that's here. So uh, yeah, beautiful to come here and jump in the pool where I'll show you some of the cabin. Um, tomorrow morning at some stage and where we're staying at the park it's stunning here just beautiful and then we'll get into the fishing all right i'll wrap up tonight we're going to the bowls club for dinner I'm frothing, eh? The wind is up this morning, but the froth is high as. We're out off weeper this morning, folks, and uh, never hit it before. 
There's uh, plenty of action already, as in boats everywhere. And uh, I'm gonna try and tuck out of a little creek, find some rock bars, maybe hit some reefs. I've got heaps of lures in. Let's get ripping into it, hey? Let's go. 3,000 kilometers. A thousand of it on dirt roads at this point, I reckon, and uh, corrugations and some off-road. And uh, boy, am I excited. The, the morning is just getting started. I'm straight across from the main mining port now. All last night, I was up till late. You can probably hear it in my voice. The kids were insane last night, every hour or so. But uh, I'm not gonna miss anything on this trip. Seems like it's still a little bit high up in there. There's a lot of mangrove there. We'll be fishing a plastic into it, so I'll just see if I can get anything off the edges. And if it doesn't happen, then I'm going to hit the, uh, the outside sandbanks and maybe do a quick scoot up, see if there's any exposed timber or the exposed banks where I can fish, where the, where the bait's going to be getting pushed off the bank. If that's not happening, if I'm too early, or there's not enough tide in it today, then I'm just going to have to change and get out on the uh, out on the reef, out on the flat. Is not happening in here yet. <laughs> Say so yet because there's plenty of bait and uh, there's some bust ups around but I reckon it's mostly trevally so what I'm going to do I'm going to change my tack I'm going to head out onto a rock wall or some more open water where there might be a little bit more flow. Hopefully we can convert and then work something out so we can bring the kids out a little bit later on and get them onto some fish. Yes! Cottage! <laughs> Saw him come up out of it too, that's beautiful. A little bit more size would be good, but there's a start. Little cottage, beautiful little fish. God, they're gorgeous. <laughs> they're so aggressive too, jeez. I love them for their aggression. See you buddy. A little bit bigger, the tide's just started to move last couple of minutes and I've been seeing a little bit more bait action shushing around the surface maybe it's coming on come on oh another hit yep oh it's a better fish that's it Come here, another cottage. <laughs> Mate, I don't know what's gonna happen when I get a proper size fish. <laughs> because, geez, they feel good. They feel good on this snapper setup. He has just smashed that little plastic. God. Let go of it, buddy. <laughs> He's not giving the tail up. See, you, mate. There's some fish, come on, got, oh, right off that edge and I could see him guys, just come straight out off the ledge, come on, oh, I just flew out and it's so shallow in there, yeah, oh, yeah, got, oh, come on, just grab it properly, some crazy little speedster on the top. Yeah, oh, right off the edge of those rocks, jeez, come on the boys, come on boys, got it this time, oh, <laughs> mate, these cod are thick, hey, they get everything first, Dave, it's almost like I've got to size up a little bit, just go a bit bigger or something, try and get away from these cod. 
Yes, now I'm on. There's something good. It's a dirty cooter. Ah, get out of it. <laughs> Stop it, man. Oh, it's just a problem because I got a bit. <laughs> and they, get, they just bite and stink. <laughs> and, uh, see you later. This, is, this has just got to happen on this side. Look at this. Mate, do I even bother? That looks too easy. Are they even on it? They are on it, and they're good fighting fish too. Look at this, look at this go. Oh, mate. I reckon I know what this is, and I've never caught one before, mate. They go so hard. Jesus. Oh, he's reefed me, I think. Get out of it. Oh. Oh, man. Oh, it's because he'd missed it. It's because he missed it, little Queenie. Morning, darling. Hello, my love. Are you all right after a hectic night? No, in oh, darling. No way. Yeah, for sure. Waiting for an appointment. Yep. Um, Dad will bring Tommy down. Has he spoken to you yet? Not yet. Okay, well, maybe just give him a ring and invite them down onto the boat. Oh, is it her ear? Yep. But Tommy's really excited to get out on the boat, so where are you? Um, I'm at an amazing spot. It's all just turning on literally right now. I had a fish while I was talking to you. Just dropped oh, a okay. just let a queenie go. Um But yeah, I'll go I'll go back, head back to the ramp and get Tommy and That's bring fine. They're just, I think they're going back to hang out the washing and stuff. And they were gonna wait until we were done. Oh, okay. Yeah, well, there's a beautiful spot here for us, Lloyd. Okay. We're going to have a lovely morning at it. Yeah, good. Might even bring your parents over if they want to. Two trips or whatever. Here they come, here they come. I reckon I got some. Yes, I did. We are in luck, guys. Look at these big moolay coming in. All right, that's the bait you want. Hey, big one. They're the baits we want. Let's go, guys. All righty, look at those. Big moolay. Let's get them on the hooks, guys. How good, Tommy? You ready, mate? Oh, yeah, they're jolly. Mate, that's the bait. You imagine yeah. the size of the fish we're going to catch with them. Yeah, Dad. Dad, that one. Oh, we might, we might change the water, eh? Yeah. 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 Put him in, mate. Good boy. Yeah. All right, Tom. Keep the little top on them so they don't get too hot. And out we go, guys. A few drifts, eh? This could be the biggest fish you've seen, buddy boy. Let's get excited. Where's this rod come from, mate? Oh, it comes from the fishing company. That's right. Aaron gave it. I got one! Oh, mate, you got him. Turn around and show mum. We've come out this morning to try and chase some big fish on Tommy's rod that he got as a prize. We've got some big liveys and a run out tide. There's a squeeze point up here between a big sandbar and the rock wall there, a rock bar that comes out. So there should be some reef fish, maybe a barra, big jack. What would you like to catch, Tom? Uh, what sort of fish would you like to catch? Uh, Queenie or barra or cod? You tell mummy. A you jumping want... one! A jumping fish? <laughs> All right, maybe a barra. Yeah, maybe. All right, let's go and get ourselves in the spot. We'll get set up. 
and hopefully next time we throw the camera on, we'll be into something. Get that drag set, Tommy. Whoa, All right, that's it. nice and heavy. All right, so we've just pulled up. I'm just using the anchor function on my Minn Kota, which will kick into gear into a second. And these big mullet, right along these rocky edges, you get yeah, snapped off. So fishing was 60 pound, and this run out tide along the edges of this wall is just perfect. So I'm not leaving the livey in there too long. It's like almost like lure fishing to be fair. So I'm casting out, I'm letting it drift out a little bit, getting some line out just so it can sink down and just giving them a, a shot at it for about 30 seconds and then I'll toss it back in, let it drift straight back down through this pressure point. Into the reef, it's massive. Massive, that big one. Oh, it's on there, but it's just bricked me right in a cave. Oh, mate. They're impossible, some of these big jacks and cod and that. Dad, just swing oh. it. Swing it in, Dad. Dad, yeah, boy. Get him, Dad! Yeah, Dad, did it. Oh, that's it. Done. <laughs> Mate, it's a lot of fun. You've yeah, just got to be so quick no. with the livey. Dad, here's a big one. All right, mate, we'll get another hook on. Yes, big fish. Come here, Tom. All right, stand in the deep bit, mate. This is a big fish. Can you wind him in, buddy? Find him. It's a big one, bud. It's a massive fish, this one. You gotta keep the pressure on it. Hello. It's a giant, buddy. Dad, keep whining it, mate. Ah, oh, it's a huge one, buddy. It's a huge oh, one. My goodness. Oh, oh my goodness. He's a bird. Oh, look at him, Tom. He's a queen fish. Look at the size of that, mate. Oh. Big queenie. Yeah, he's a big queen. Wind him in, mate, on Aaron's rod. Oh, my goodness. Are you ready to lift him in? Yeah, yeah, Wind him in, mate. You got him, Tommy. Yeah. You got him, Tom. He's a giant. Oh, mate. He's a testing. On Aaron's rod from the comp. That's giant. Look at the size of it, mate. Oh. Let's get a photo, eh? You hold the rod. Yeah, I Is your fish... Where's the fish holder? Here we go, mate. You just hold it like this, look. Oh, I'm not understanding. How good, Lloyd. Look at that. Big queen. Huge queenie, mate. Up near the metre mark. What do you reckon about that? I'm going to tell Dowie this. All right. All right, come here, big cottage. That's where you want it, Lloyd. Like, toss it. <laughs> That's it. Yep, perfect. <laughs> Get ready. Get ready, Lloyd. Alright, past cottage cheeses, honey. Oh, yes, Lauren! Feed it real hard. Smash it, Lauren. Go, girl. Yes! Oh, it's red! Oh, it's a beautiful big mangrove jack, Lauren! Oh my god, look at the size of it! Oh wow! Well. It's a giant Lloydy. It's a jack, massive jack. Oh yeah, girl! <laughs> wow! That is a monster top end jack, Lauren. Put him in the net. Alright, drop that bale, Lloyd. Dad, put him in the net. Wow, look at it. Put him in the net. Tommy, look at that mangrove jack, mate. Oh, keep it up. Keep it up, Zoe. Mum, touch What do you reckon about that, Tom? <laughs> What's your secret, Lauren? Uh, Assistance, my love. <laughs> and a good wingman. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Wow, that's a giant. Well done. Lauren, you are unbelievable. There's massive bus still going. Is this dinner? Yep. 
Oh. Tonight. I'm sorry. Look at that. Look at that beauty. Hey, when we're eating them on a trip away camping, why not? How good. Dad, put them in there. Yep, he's going straight on ice, buddy. Dad, I'm going to have a picture of the big flower. Yep, yep. Something's grabbing. Yep. 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 Got it. Oh, jumping cod. Tommy, get in here, mate. Yeah. Get in there. Dad, help me. Help me. No, you do it, mate. You gotta lift him up. You gotta lift that fish up. He's a big flipper. Yeah, beautiful cod, mate. Well done. Put him in here. Are you loving your fishing, mate? Yeah. Good boy. Put him in here now. All right. Are you ready? You're going to put him back in? Let's release him. Now, hang on. I'll get to the little grips. All right. You ready to let him go? Yeah. Hands up. Good boy. Well done. It was a young one, that one. Well, folks, that is us for Weeper. The kids are in the pool and we are wrapping things up. About to leave the cars packed, but I wanted to show you this place. It's a Weeper caravan and camping site here, right on the water. Tommy's after me, he wants me in the pool, but hang on, let me see if I can show you up. There's the water there, have a look at that. And there are reefs out there with some good fishing on it. We've had a ball here. The place is really tidy, they are lovely here. And uh, beautiful little cabins that we've stayed in and really enjoyed our stay. The pool is such a luxury to come up here and be able to relax and enjoy a little bit of time in the pool. There's a play park down here for the kids and some fantastic seating there under the trees so you can watch the sunset over the water like we did yesterday afternoon. And uh, refresh, get ready for the rest of the trip. We are headed north now, we're gonna keep going. There's not a lot further to go, but I've heard there's some fantastic fishing, so I'm gonna be chasing it hard over the next couple of days. I'll keep you in on all the videos and I'll see you soon.